Five minerals. We are going to talk about jade and jadeite today. Um, probably one of the hardest minerals I've ever um, been up against trying to identify whether or not it's jade, jadeite, or any of the other plethora of green um, and white minerals. And if you go on YouTube, um, <laughs> Even the, the experts on there have a, a challenging time explaining to you what the difference is. So <clears throat> I'm going to show you something today that will guarantee that you are able to identify whether or not it's jadeite or any other mineral, including nephrite. Um, rewind a little bit. What got me interested in jadeite um, was a trip, a Benidoite hunting trip out to uh, the west coast of Japan. Um, west coast of Japan, a city called Itoigawa. Um, you can find the description in the link below. I'll leave some links to um, websites out there. But So I went on a, on a hunting trip out there to look for Benidoite. And um, the whole mountain range over there is composed of serpentine and serpentine minerals uh, which include um, oftentimes jade jadeite yeah, sorry jadeite i keep <laughs> pronouncing it wrong and um, nephrite jade and of course benidoite so while i was there i wasn't lucky enough to um, actually collect jadeite on the beach but i did get some nephrites these two, um, and I stopped by the gift shop um, in the in museum there, fantastic museum. If you get a chance to go out there, you have to stop by the museum. Um, really world-class, and and the jadeite specimens they have are unbelievable. I'll, I'll throw some pictures in um, at the end of the video. Um, so I picked up a dirty piece of jade. This was just a a sample that I could have to um, look at to reference what I'm looking for when I'm trying to identify jade. I also picked up the other uh, various colors that it Itoigawa jadeite, jadeite comes in, which are, of course, the wonderful green, lavender, black, blue, more green, and white. And here we have a piece of blue. And I believe this one is blue as well. It may be uh, blue lavender. So <clears throat> now let's, let's talk about how to actually tell the difference between jadeite and nephrite or any of the other uh, green minerals. I'm going to stop the video real quick so I can put on my um, lens on the phone and we'll get a close-up of this guy here and you'll see right away how you can tell if it's jadeite. Be right back. Okay, and we're back. We're looking at the rough edge. See if that can zoom in. Um, the rough edge that hasn't been disturbed of the jadeite. Again, you could confuse this with quite a few other minerals. So what we want to do is turn it over to the cut side. Now, what you're going to notice are little speckles in the in the jadeite. I'm trying to find a good one. And sorry, my hands are kind of jittery. Uh, let's see, let's turn it over. Uh, there, we're starting to see some here. They, they kind of reflect the light back at you. There's one right there. Sorry, my dirty fingernail. See that? And you can kind of 
See other ones here and there? It depends on how you turn the piece of jadeite, but you can see the reflections back and forth as I move this around. That's not such a good side. I had a really good one earlier and I forgot where it went. But anyways, there you can there you can see them there. See how you can see those little reflections? Those are the crystals are interlocked in just completely random patterns. And that is how you can tell when you see those reflections like that those little shining pieces back at you. That's how you know it's JDI. JDI. Um, which one had, I think it was the blue one, had some really good shine to it as well. Sorry, my fingernails are dirty. I'm a rock hound, what do you expect? So you can kind of see those reflections in this piece. As I turn it around, yeah, there they are. That's real jadeite right there. And for anyone wondering, the blue is caused by uh, titanium inclusions. Same uh, for the lavender. And titanium is also one of the minerals in benitoite, which is how the benitoite gets grows over in the same area. Beautiful stuff. So that's how you can tell jadeite, real jadeite. Now nephrite jade doesn't have those little reflections that shiny there there you can see a couple of them. ding 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 doesn't have that um those shiny uh grains inside of them so here's a a nice little is this not oh, let's use this one this is a nice piece of nephrite uh that i got off the beach in utoigawa um it's free to collect over there <coughs> they have tons and tons of, of minerals on the rocky beaches there. I'll show you a picture again at the end of the video um, from my rock hounding trip out there. Anything, um, let's see, chromite. I think they have yovarovite, um, nephrite, what else, agates, um, of course, serpentine, and uh, what else? Yvarvite, chromite, um, yeah, just lots of green, <laughs> green basement minerals. So this is a, a nice piece of nephrite that I got off the beach, light boxing it for you. <clears throat> and you get a close up. It doesn't have those little reflections that the jadeite has. So this is this is still jade. It's just a different variety of jade. <clears throat> and let's take a look again. This is a rough piece of blue lavender jade. You can kind of see some of the reflections coming back at you. We'll light box it and show you what it looks like. Yeah, there, see, you can see blue green color. Really awesome stuff. So, <clears throat> I hope that's helped. Oh, let's talk about this California piece real quick here. So I, I ordered this piece of um, Clear Creek jadeite online and because I, I needed some um, California specimens. I have to 
polish it down so I can see the I, I know it's data um, because I've, I've looked at it really closely under a loop but I'm polishing this edge down over here um, so I can show to you know the the non-sophisticated collector the similarities between this piece and what we're gonna have show up here <clears throat> um, so the California uh, jadeite comes from uh, Clear Creek um, the new I think it's pronounced Idria mining district which is up um, in Central California near uh, Colinga California so if you're looking at a map look at Coing Colinga and then head west inland um, and it's up in the mountains up there again very similar um, very, very similar rocks in um, in and around Clear Creek so lots of serpentine um, which produces or which also is found with jadeite serpentine nephrite and then of course um, the benitoite so I got this piece and I've been figuring out whether or not it is real jade and sure enough it is and so I'll be buying some more from um, the individual that I purchased it off of and taking it back to Japan with me um, this summer I'm going hunting out in Itoigawa with um, a Japanese mineral club that we just my wife and I just joined and hopefully we're gonna get some some big nice pieces of, of jadeite and if we're really really lucky I've got my shortwave UV light that I always bring with me when I'm out there hunting for that elusive benitoite but anyways I hope this helped you um, understand how to one surefire way to identify jadeite versus nephrite and any of the green white minerals um, leave a comment below and i'll try to answer any questions you have uh, thanks for watching